Okay. Tell me if this looks any better. I lowered the resolution and a couple other things. The game is still slightly laggy, so if you see a little bit of, like, stutter, that is my game. It seems to be okay based on what I'm looking at here, though. Man, I'm gonna have to find everything again. Fuck this. <laughs> I'm going for the crystal lizard right away, too. Why not? I have so many things I need to catch up. Slightly stuttery, but much better. Okay. I'll take it. I can do some more fine-tuning at a later point. Yeah, I'll fight the crystal lizard. Okay. I forgot I am not quite how I used to be in terms of strength. Wow. Crystal Lizard is... tough when I'm not prepared for it. That's okay. We can work with this. Come on. Can you, like... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come here. You know what? I'm gonna come back for the Crystal Lizard. I'm probably gonna get killed by it. That's okay. I'll be okay. Oh, I don't think I ever went up here, actually. Is this anything? No. Alright, cool. We're gonna come back for that later. Yeah, I think the slight stuttering is my game. It's not the stream. So I think we're about as good as we can make it right now. Stop it. Oh boy. So yeah, if anyone here is not in the new Discord, you can do exclamation point Discord to get the link to it. I did update my commands so that they are accurate now. Feel free to drop by. I built it all back up. It should all be good to go. And uh, yeah. Hold the person. I, I hope they didn't get hold of anything important too. I should be okay though for the most part. Um, I've already canceled my credit card, so I have a new one on the way. I the only thing I'm worried about is like the friends I have on that Discord that I don't have any other way to contact. Like there's one person in particular that I was talking to recently and really enjoying conversations with, and like just like a overall really good friend to have around, and I have no way to contact them. Absolutely no way to contact them. We met on Reddit and they deleted their Reddit account. I only know their username, not like the numbers attached to it. So hopefully they drop by a stream at one of these times. So I can be like, hey, my Discord got hacked. You want to like add me? Uh, also, this is a good point to say, if anyone has any doubts, Lily Aria is me. That is my account. That if, I, if you got a DM from me, that is in fact me. You can take my word for it. Um, same with the Pavati account. I got that one back, so that one is safe. Though I haven't used that one since, like, day one of the hacking. You know, this area is going to be a lot easier going forward because I've already done it all. It definitely feels good to get back into this. I will say also this is kind of like a blessing in disguise because, like, I will be able to have a little bit more freedom now going for- Oh, jump, right. Forgot about that. Um, I'll be able to kind of- Forgot about you as well. Resort out my content and prioritize things differently. Kind of shift away from Dark Souls and towards other stuff. Not, like, completely away from Dark Souls, but, you know, like, let- give other things time to breathe and, like- play Dark Souls in my free time, which I've been wanting to do anyway, so this is great. Damn it. This will also give me an opportunity to mess around with different builds a little bit more. I do love my longsword, and I'm still going to get it back to a plus 10 how I had it before, but it's going to be nice to um, kind of experiment a little bit too on this playthrough. Like, one thing I definitely want to do, and I'll probably get there before the end of the stream, I want to get to Vort, and I want to trans... 
Where do I get the transpose kiln thing? I don't remember that. But I want to get his hammer. Vort's hammer is apparently pretty good. Also, should I go to Firelink and come back? No, fuck it. We'll fight him. Oh, no, because we can't link the fire or whatever without the coiled sword, so I do need this. All right. Come on, I got you. Oh, I forgot he does punchy things, too. I'll probably die to him a couple times. That's okay. I don't really remember his attack patterns fully. I get the kill. Oh, from the curse rod of Great Wood. Okay. All right, first try. Not bad. Granted, he is like the tutorial boss. We got our ember. We're good. Okay, so I have to get all the way to the catacombs before I can even use Vort's hammer. Uh, Shield Maiden, if there's any items that you think that I should go out of my way for, or, like, think that I should, like, work towards, or, yeah, use this because it's stronger, or, you know, uh, allot my points a certain way, let me know. I'm allowing full backseating for this stream. 100% backseating of any type is allowed. Be because I've already seen up until Lothric Castle. And I'm trying to get back to that point. So I'll do anything to be as broken as possible. If you're like, hey, you might want to go out of your way to this area to get this item. Or something, you know? Oh, wait, not catacombs. I didn't mean catacombs. I meant, um... The settlement. My bad. I have to get through... Quite a bit of the undead settlement before I can get the kiln. That's what I meant. I don't know why I said catacombs. Maybe I have the catacombs on my mind. Um, I don't remember a lot of the side paths either, so I'm just gonna... I'm exploring a lot of this as if it's my first time. And I am gonna have to do fair and keep and everything again as well. Ugh. I mean, granted, I'm gonna have to do everything again. I know I can shortcut to get uh, above Fire Link as well if I jump off the tree. I almost got it before when I was trying it. Oh, the naked dude's over here. How about he can come fuck me up a little bit too? Definitely don't know that I'm ready for him. We'll give it a go. Do I want to go to Fire Link first? We want to go to Fire Link first. Go for fast decks or strong strength weapons. Whatever is the most overpowered possible thing I could do. Literally, just tell me how to destroy everything in my path. Because I can always, like, redo it at, um... The Cathedral of the Deep. I know I, I should have gone, like, made, like spellcasting or something. And I shouldn't have gone knight, but I'm already... You know, I'm already locked into night because that's just what I knew. I didn't think about that. Okay, first thing I want to do is go for full Estus because I never use the other Estus. Okay. Yeah, so like literally just tell me like go for this, whatever, I'll do it. Um, I don't, like do I want to get any of these? Daggers, short sword, curved sword. I think I'm fine for right now. Soul arrow? No. Ashen one. Ashen one. Yeah, like when I'm off off stream, I'm going to be like trying every. My brain is like a hundred different places right now. 
when I'm off stream, I'm going to be following all sorts of guides to make sure I get all the quest lines and all of the, um... Estus shards, undead bone shards, etc. 15 strength, 2 hand, and 30 to 1 hand. Claymore... Of course, the Claymore. Uh, so are what, you, what you're saying is I should be specking into strength for the most part. I also heard that... What is it? Vigor is health? I heard that, like, boosting that up is so good against PvE. So I could do that as well. Let's see. Can I deal with you? You're not bad. Yeah. Yeah, I can deal with this guy. Okay, he inflicts bleeding. Something to keep in mind. Yeah, you're gonna do a big old thing, right? Mm, he's got me here. While he's getting back up, I'll Estus again. Get my stamina back up, and he's down. Wow, he's a lot easier when I actually know what I'm going up against. I could equip that, right? Requires more decks. Okay. What does the armor he just gave me look like? Um, I don't really care for it. I'm fine staying knight. And then this doesn't unlock until I come from the other side. I think, what, this is the grave site? Yeah. There's the roof. If I go up on the... Okay. I vaguely remember where a lot of the stuff is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. Thank you. So can I just, like, walk over here to get to the thing? No, because it's up on a higher level, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because normally I would need the tower key to get up there. And that was, if I remember, like, something like... I don't remember. It was, like, 20,000 souls or 10,000 or something. Which, are, if, we're, if it's 10,000, we're, like, halfway there already. Oh my god, the game is lagging like crazy. Not really lagging, it's just frame drops. Mm, I should probably go sit down again at the bonfire. Eh, do we need to? We don't need to, right? What? Examine? A seed of a giant tree is yet to fall? I never noticed that before. But like, is this worth it? I don't know how worth it this rooftop is. I could probably get it though, right? It'll be worth it, maybe. It'll, it's gotta be worth it. It's gotta be worth it because all the speedrunners do it, right? Right? You believe? Okay. I will believe then. I feel like it's like a very precise moment where I have to turn on this tree. Because if I turn too soon, I just do that. If I turn too late, I go upwards. You guys really shouldn't be... Shouldn't be believing in my nonsense here, but thank you. I'll take it. I don't know if it's worth it. I don't know if it's worth it. I had the exact same conversation... ...when I first came here. I thought that was gonna be it, if I'm being- OH! I'm getting higher on the tree. Oh, I can get higher on, like, this side. 
And then I immediately slide back down it. So if I, like... No. Alright, I, I don't know. Is Like, tell me genuinely. Should, should I be... The key costs 20k, so it's worth it at least for that, yeah. And then if I get through there, can I unlock the door from the other side without the key? I guess that's one thing that I'm wondering about, too. Like, is that how doors work in this game? Oh, there we go. We got it. I don't really remember what else was up here. This leads up to the top up here, which is where I talked to Pee Pee Pooperoo or whatever his name is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We get an Estus shard out of it. I mean, that's pretty big. Yeah, can we get some nices in chat? <laughs> just, just fill the chat with nices. <laughs> Illusory wall. Where? Is it up here, or is it down? <laughs> nice, 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 nice. Yeah, where's the illusory wall? Also, Redbeard and Dave, welcome in. I think for right now... Straightforward, oh, okay. From where? Like... Straight across from the end from here. Oh, I didn't see this before either. What does this lead to? Okay, I will jump down from there in a bit. I'm gonna see if I can pump a rum. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Thank you. Rot, rot, rot. Bird, bird, bird. Um, I'm going to test my theory about opening doors from the other side. You just remembered the wall. Okay, that's cool. It's still things that I didn't have before. Oh, wait. Wait, can I not go up higher? Did I misunderstand this completely? Oh, well, that's a bummer. So I guess, is that the only thing I can do up here, then? I thought I could, like, go up there and everything into, like, the tower. I suppose not, though. Because this just leads me... Oh, wait, can I go... I didn't check if I can go, like, up and around... This way? Ah, uh, yep, yep, yep. Okay, cool, cool. I can go this way. I did remember it correctly. You have a busy night plan? No worries, my dude. Enjoy your night. Oh, I'm gonna have to do fucking, um... Yurthil Dungeon again, too. Oh, wait, no. This doesn't bring me to the tower, either. So, I guess I can't actually get up higher from this path. I can only go into the top of Firelink. Which, unfortunate, but hey, it's still something. So, let's see what we actually get out of this. So it was this way and then straight. Me, me. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, pff, I was looking at chat. God damn it. <laughs> Somehow survived that. Not that it matters. Yeah, if I died there, that I could have just walked up and grabbed my souls. But hey, uh, Esther Shard already. Before even going into any areas, we have an extra Estus Flask. That is very helpful. Oop. I can't reinforce anything yet. That's fine. Pretty be careful. Pretty be careful. Check out my suggestion box. Exclamation point Discord to head over to the Discord. And then you'll have your, um... Oh, I have to jump again. Oh, no. I need to know what's behind that illusory wall. I need to know. Oh, here we go again. 
Cue the epic montage music. Actually, you know what? You know what? Here's what we're gonna do. There we go. We got this. We're gonna make this jump if it's the last goddamn thing I do on stream. Here we go. Even if it takes me 25 years, I'm going to make it. I'm gonna make it faster than last time, though, that's for sure. Oh. Hi! Oh, okay, fine. <laughs> I'll accept that fail. It's all about the trials, the tribulation, and doing your best. And we'll get it. We'll goddamn do it. If there's one thing that getting over it with Bennett Fo Foddy taught me and Jump King taught me, if you've done it once, you can do it again. Even if it takes you forever, you gotta believe in yourself. You gotta believe in those around you. And you gotta carry the belief of others on your shoulder. Oh, wait, let me get this item, too. That's okay. I can do it! I know I can! Come on, now! That felt good. That felt real good. That was really close. The worst part is I don't even know what exactly... That felt like the best jump yet. But it's not the best if we don't succeed. It's only a good attempt. It can't be the best if it's a fail. It's not a fail if it... Thank you. Thank you for believing in me. Okay. Enough of that. And we get a dab. We'll dab to that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, boy. <laughs> now, after all that trial and tribulation, let's see if it was even worth it. Okay. So, from here, don't look at chat. Don't look at chat. Just walk. Just walk forward and drop down right ahead. Okay. A chest. Could this be an illusory wall? Do I trust it, or did it bring me to a Mimic and Fire Link? Let's see. It looks like a legitimate chest, maybe? I'll give it a second before I do anything. Covetous Silver Serpent Ring was what we ended up getting. Well, I needed all the rings anyway, so either way, that's helpful. Uh, also, the starting thing I did was Life Ring, just for a little bit of extra HP. That'll help me early game, because the Divine Blessing that I originally started with, I never used, and by the time that I would have used it, I can already buy them, so I didn't bother. Ooh, more souls per Fallen Foes? Yeah, I'll take that. Um, cool. And now do we just drop to our Doom here? Yeah, I, get, I mean, this seems like... Uh, not that bad of a drop, actually. Never mind. All right. Well, let's level up. What do we want to level up? Do a ton of vigor for starters, I think. Wait. Yes. I want to do a ton of vigor just to start it out. Ooh, look at that health bar. I'm going to be putting more into, like, uh, strength and stuff later. Don't worry. That's a nice health bar to start out with, though. Okay, let me just see... 
Why am I getting notifications about Ryan Reynolds? Okay, so why do I have two pings? I only got... Oh, a friend request. We spin in. We out here spin in. You're a good chat. You deserve a heart. Everyone in... Okay, um, Cheddar. Ways you can, um, celebrate chat. Exclamation point hug all. There's also exclamation point free hug, which will hug a completely random person who has chatted recently. That way you can show your appreciation through fancy commands. Okay, we're at the high wall of Lothric again. It feels like we're back home. There we go. There's a nice hug all. You gave yourself a hug. <laughs> that's great. I forgot that's something that can happen. Uh, so... The right was the shortcut. I haven't unlocked that yet. Left was progress, but there was also something on the other wall over there. Let's start with this. We'll go this way first. Maybe we can get like a couple of item drops as well. Okay, dogs take three hits right now. I'm going to keep that in mind. That only took two, though. Hey, buddy. I agree. You absolutely need to appreciate yourself. Self-love and self-care, baby. That's what the server's all about. All the server, wow. That's what this community is all about. So one of the guys here is going to turn into a big rage monster. Which one was it? You. Was it him? I think it was him. We got an arrow, a bow and arrow. That's going to be helpful to us. For some long range stuff, you know? Do I need anything slotted in to use the bow, though? I need a little bit of dexterity. I mean, I can still use it. So, does that just mean that I don't do its full damage or something? Is that what that means? Mm, so, this was the way to the shortcut. There's this dude. There's a guy that pops up to my right. Alright. Not afraid of you. There's an item here, though. Yeah, so that's locked up. This guy wakes up. It's astounding how much you can remember this game. It does almost no damage. Gotcha. So, that's it for this path. Still haven't used an Estus Flask, so we're going to just keep on trucking along. Even if I used one, it would still be better than my first time through here. And I'm much more skilled than I was back then. So it doesn't super matter. Guy to the right, guy to the left, guy down the middle. Thank you. One of these guys gets up. Was it you? No, I see him over here. It's you. Yeah, I see the other one coming up. The rest of you are pretty chill. Yeah, I this is going to be rough cuz like I said, I don't remember where like anything is. Like in terms of like items and stuff, I'll have to remember like the side paths and like all the shortcuts and stuff. Uh, I remember fire bombs being super helpful early on. So let's do fire bombs on there. Let's put homeward bone on there. What are these anyway? Lose souls and return to a bonfire. Banish visiting phantom or return home. Restore link to other worlds. Hmm. I never messed with those. I never really looked into that. So I'm guessing the if I run out of homeward bones, I can still use that other thing to like 
go back to my bonfire, but I'll lose a little bit of uh, souls for that. And that's nice to know that that exists. And I guess I can go up the dragon path without worrying too much. If I just run. This will lead me right to a bonfire room too, I'm pretty sure. There's a lot of items here for Estus. Yeah, let's go. Why am I not running? We got your claymore. I need more strength, more dex. But I could use that. Yeah, no, I, I distinctly remember as I was running over there, I'm like, wait, this is where I get the claymore, isn't it? There's also a mimic here. Can I deal with a mimic right now? I guess we'll find out. Not yet. I'll come back for this mimic because there's a bonfire... I vaguely know where the bonfire is from here. There's a Knight of Lothric here that I have to get by. Yeah, can I deal with him? One Estus? Probably. You know what? Let's just ignore him for the time being. I can come back. Because I think the... What is it? Right up here? Yeah. Oh, I'm being chased, though. That knight had my cool cape! Oh, I need to get it from him. I need to go back. I think the one thing that I'm missing the most is, um... What is it called again? Um... I don't remember the name. Maybe you can remind me. But it's the ring that gives me the increased stamina recovery that I had. Where do I get that? I remember it was fairly early on. Yeah, you ain't got nothing on me. I know how to deal with you. No big deal. Chloranthi ring? Yeah, if you could look that up, I'd really appreciate that. Because I'm definitely missing that. This leads to that rooftop with the ragey dude. Downstairs is... I think it's the cage where Grey Rat is, which I don't have the key for. I'm just going to confirm that real quick. You never played Dark Souls, you just ate all the lore? I mean, that's another valid way to experience it, to be fair. The lore in and of itself is a wonderful story that you can just read and listen to and watch. But this is locked. Did I ever come through here? I don't remember that door. I don't think I ever unlocked that door. You guys are going to come all like, Rawr, through the barrels. No, you're just going to try to blow me up. Got it. Oh, I still get items here, so... Even though I can't free my pal, we got a mail breaker. Is the mail breaker any good? 
Better, mm, better crit, lower attack, heavier. I'm sticking with the, I'm sticking with the long sword. I know that's a sentence you never thought you would hear in this playthrough, right? Hey, gray rat, how you doing, buddy? After the fire demon with Siegfried. Okay. So basically, all of my good progress is gonna be after undead settlement. Because then I can use Vort's hammer, then I can get my Chloranthi ring. Okay. That's fine. Slowly but surely, we'll regain everything we had. So, I another thing that I want to make sure is... um. What was that one guy's name? It's like Yom or Yol or something like that. I want to make sure he survives. Uh, I want to make sure that I do the on request line correctly this time. Horus just dies. That's just canonical. Okay, I know which one of the dudes rages out over here, so we'll go for that. I never went back for the Mimic. I'll go for the Mimic. Mimic could have a useful item for me. You never know. For now, I'll just have to settle, Mint. Very true. Was there any items down this path? No, just the wave of enemies, right? Was there an item over there? No, you didn't hear a thing. I'm not actually here. Okay. Mimic, how you doing? Ooh, will I be able to handle this, actually? Maybe not. Shit, dude. No, I just gotta believe. I'm gonna try to grab me. Try to grab me, that's gonna be my best window. Nope. Oh! We got it! First try. You have to get his free level up and then die a bunch to get four more free levels before killing the Abyss Watchers. Is that gonna fuck me over at all? I don't know how that works. This has dark damage. Maybe I should try this. We'll mess with it a little bit. Get his free level up, then die a bunch to get four more free levels before killing the Abyss Watchers. Is that worth it? I don't know if it's worth it or not. I mean, sure, we'll we'll run with this for right now, though. So this is the bonfire, and then we go... From here, we do go down, right? I'll use whatever gives me the edge here. No shame. No preferences or biases. We just do what works. If I have to abandon my longsword for a bit, so be it. Which one are you, is it? It's you. Fuck, I didn't make it in time. Um... We redo. If I go to the bonfire, I can probably just respawn him as a normal dude. I couldn't quite remember which one it was, so I kind of, like, hesitated for a moment. 
And I don't know if the extra dark damage is actually beneficial to me here, but I'm gonna roll with this. They're not like... They're hard, and they hit hard. I just know that I can kill him before he turns into that. And then I don't even have to worry about it. They they jump around. There's also a lot of items on that roof, too. And I want to grab as much as I can. I know, someone's behind me. Didn't end up following me. Oh, hi! Jesus, dude! Okay, so we know which one it is. I don't think I can kill him in time. Not with what I've got. Fine, I'll just see what I can grab before I run off. A raw gem, that could help me out early game. Especially if I'm not specking too much into the other stats. I don't know if this axe is the way to go. It doesn't feel too bad, but it also... Let me... Let me compare the DPS with my normal longsword. And this isn't just me doing longsword favoritism. I genuinely want to test how my sword does. I think it's... Ooh, hi. I think it's genuinely quicker to just use my longsword. Oh, Goop Dude is right above me, isn't he? Yeah, he's, like, right on top of me. Undead Hunter Charm. That doesn't help me at all. Hey, you. Got to keep an eye on my stamina. Remember, he can smack me with his shield, too. There we go. He's taken care of. Oh, yeah. Of course he's going to hit me with the lantern, because that causes fire damage. I don't know. I'm just trying to make it up to make it sound more convincing. Okay, but like genuinely, give me one second. Why am I lagging so badly? I'm gonna see if I can. My dad. Hmm. What do I have open that could be causing this issue? Open up Task Manager real quick. Oh yeah, we are chugging along right now. Between OBS and Dark Souls. Can I somehow make this not chug along as much? Why is OBS... Hmm. Oh, I think I know why. I think this is exactly why I had Dark Souls on my C drive and not my, my backup drive was because it's a, a faster game, so I would want it on my main... Uh, boy. Okay. Okay. I might have to yet again reinstall Dark Souls. I'll do it after the stream. I'll just deal with it right now. Um, But I'm going to move... I'm going to actually keep my save file and move it over this time. Be smart about it. I didn't come over here before, did I? 
Uh, if you drop down here, you just want the I mean, uh, just got that item. You can get a sword that's. You just got that item. You can get a sword that's really strong to raw gem. Missed chest. Oh, right over there. Actual chest. Actual chest. A store straight sword. You think that's gonna be good with the raw gem? Uh, it also is gonna require. Oh, it's gonna require some. What is that? Faith? Is that what that's called? But if I no, that would be the attribute bonus. Okay, I'll keep that in my uh, back pocket for later. Come on, take me on all at once, you cowards! I take it back. Don't don't take me on at all. Yeesh! One thing never changes, no matter how many save files I use. I'm cocky as fuck. That didn't flinch when I hit it. Okay, we got another shield. I'm out of Estus. This is okay. This is okay. Silver Eagle Kite Shield has less guard absorption. It's also heavier. Has better attack power. I don't really care for that. Good to have on hand, maybe, though? Question mark? Since I am a collector, after all. First and foremost. I know this is also where I get an Estus Shard. Took me forever to find it, but it's right here. Good to have. Alright, TARDIS, take it easy. Have an amazing night, my friend. Catch you on the Discord at a later point in time. There's also an item. Oh, there it is. Just a Titanite shard. I say just a Titanite shard. That's going to help me this early game, but... Whatever. We good. We appreciate all that we find. I'm just remembering on my main file having, like, so many Titanite shards that I never use because I never upgraded anything but my longsword. Cell key? Is that for Grey Rat? I'm gonna guess that's for Grey Rat. Okay, that's Grey Rat. Was there anything else here? Hmm, I think that was it. There you go. That was here too. Get a broadsword. My gooby dude is going off. Alright, cool. We get this. A black fire bomb, okay. Nothing to drop down to, right? Mm. No. So I'm thinking we go to where the shortcut is. And go back since I'm out of Estus. I trust myself enough. Think I could be Dancer? No, nah, I don't know about that. Thank you for believing in me. I don't feel like I need to be stealthy with this guy, though. I know a guy drops down from up there. Or was it just that guy? Yeah, we're fine. I'm going this way. Let me go up here. He's still behind me, isn't he? Is 
she she's persistent Let's grab everything I can oh got another Estus somewhere along the way that's cool use that real quick Should I use Dark against Vort? Like the deep battle axe? Is he... Does that a thing that... Does that help me? That guy just fell down the pit, right? Yep. Okay, so now we're here. Should have seen that coming. We unlocked the shortcut, though. He is weak to dark. Okay. I kind of feel like I knew that. Because I, I read somewhere that the dancer is also sh uh, weak to dark. And I figured, like, they're both ice be ice beasts, ice-based. So I figured there was a correlation there. Maybe ice is weak to dark. Mm, so now that I got that, I did get another Estus Shard. And then we'll level up as well. Okay. We're also going to reinforce our weapon. I'm... I gotta build up my longsword, I'm sorry. So what do you recommend then? Should I build up the uh, deep battle axe, the claymore, or the Astora straight sword in terms of like, building up my stats? Because, hold on, hold your hold your horses for a moment, woman. Um, Cause you said the Uchi Katana's fine, you, re you really like the claymore. You also said this is really good as a raw item, but then I would need to add more into faith, which I'm fine doing if I need to. There's also... Yeah, it's just basically these two, right? Then I would need 14... I need 14 dex. 16 strength. Fuck it. Welcome. Very well. Then hit. 14. I can do 14 and 14 for right now. I can't do faith right now. That would take way too much souls. Too too much, too many. I mean, I have them. Fuck it. I never used them in the base game. Let's use them now. <laughs> Why not get all the levels we can early on? Gripping gameplay. You never tried it, but it says it was really strong. Got it. That didn't give us quite as much as I thought it would. I can get one more point out of all that. Uh, that's fine. I'll work towards the claymore. May the flames guide thee. Okay, can I unequip shit? Is that an option? If I just like remove, got it. Oh, you know what I didn't get yet? Oh, I'm gonna have to do some searching in here. Oh, this is bad. I never got the binoculars. Damn, I need to go back and find those binoculars. Where were they? They were in the high wall of Lothric. Lord knows I cannot continue without the binoculars. Where where did I miss? I don't actually remember.
You can sell them to the ashes, lady? Okay, good to know. Get out of here, you goon. I'm here to free my friend. You're a goon as well. You're all goons. You're alive. Oh, great rat. I've come to rescue thee. Hi. How you doing? Great talk. So glad we talked about that. What does that do for me again? Increases damage absorption when the HP is low? Why not? I don't really have much equipped right now. I might as well just equip everything I get for the time being. What are you doing? What do you think you're doing? Can you move for me, please? Alright, well, cool. I'm glad we had this discussion. Going back up to the bonfire, if you just excuse me real quick. I don't remember how much it was for the next soul level. I should be fighting them. I'm I know what to do, actually. I know how to get some quick, easy souls. You ready for this, guys? The winning strategy? Like, yeah, there's the obvious, right? Deal with these guys, fight them, kill them, get souls. That much is obvious. However, I was thinking something more along the lines of this. Dragon, you want to do your breathy thing? Why did they not get hurt? Why did they not get hurt down there? You freak? Why are you being such a freak, dragon? Hey, dragon, breathe your fire down here. I'll just... I'll just be sneaking by you. Thank you. Oh, that's stinky. All right, Knight of Lothric. How many souls are you gonna drop for me? How many souls are you gonna drop for me, huh? How many souls will you drop for me? Not as many as I'd hoped. Thank you. I am definitely getting better at this game. Uh, thank you. All right, we're gonna go down and fight Vort, I think. Once we get the Vort bonfire, I'll fuck around in the, um, the courtyard area. Maybe I can find some cool stuff. Hello, hello? Anyone want to wanna do some neat things? That was mean. Bye. All right, cool. <laughs> Peace. And down he goes. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. 
Just ignore everything for right now. I know this courtyard so well because I ran up here so many times. Alright, now that we're in the Vort area... You're not going to follow me in, right? Okay. Uh, I'm going to equip green blossoms as well. I don't. I never really used them. But they'll be good to have on hand. Ember, I should also have. Even though I'm already embered up. I'll... Yeah, focus is booty. I learned that from my first time fighting him. We still have a pretty quick roll. We're good. Hi, Bort. It's been a while. Coming for your booty. Oh, he farted on me. Ow. All right, bud. Okay, I'm getting a little sloppy. Thank you. Easy peasy. S sticks and treesy. First try, Vort. Okay, now I can get your claymore. I'll try messing with it. I'll try feeling it out as like a proper... I can use it at this level kind of weapon, you know? Let's give it a go. You. Yeah, yeah, that, yeah, that, that. Okay. Give me one in strength. I can do one more stat. Let's go into a little more stamina, a little more endurance. Farewell. Okay, now we can use the claymore. can go back to Vort. I can check out the courtyard here. Kill everything. Get all the items. Kill the, the blue knight. Get the banner from the lady by the dancer fight. I know how to summon the dancer now. So I can just avoid doing that until I'm ready. Until I want to. I'd be curious to try fighting the dancer right now. But I'm not going to. Oh, I'm heavy. I'm heavy rolling. I mean, yeah, I'll definitely admit that it's very strong right now. You can't really compare it to a plus 10 longsword to a base claymore. So it was kind of unfair, the level I was comparing them to. Oh, look at me. I guess we'll go with this for a little bit. Why not? Uh, what other, what other items can I get here? Hey, buddy. I see you. Uh. 
There we go. Some you like my armor? Thank you, Taco. How you doing today, my friend? Howdy, howdy. I'll fight you as well. Got the Lucerne. I remember looking into that a little bit. This is all just dandy. I got you. You played cart? Nice. I'm finally embracing fashion. No, I'm embracing, hey, this is making me heavy. I should do something lighter. But, you know, I'll take it. So I'll grab my banner from in here. I'm not going to dancer. No items here either, right? Yeah. Hi. Thanks, Emma. Good talk. I'm really glad we had this conversation. Where would I be without you? Uh, he's another Estus. We're not really doing anything that's worth, like, saving Estus for right now. Hi. Okay, I hate using two-handed. I did it because I was like, ooh, big damage, but I hate it. Is this Monster Hunter World? Yeah. As you know, I'm a huge fan of the Monster Hunter series. Yeah, I kind of saw that coming. Yeah, I was trying two-handed because I was like, ooh, extra damage. And then I tried some strong attacks. Because I, I never use strong attacks, ever. Not even with my longsword. Okay, I'm sorry, but let me... Let me just try my longsword for this area. The claymore does really good damage, but I do want to try... Just to compare, again... Okay, we're talking two hits versus three hits on these guys right now. So that is a pretty major difference already. Those guys are two hits either way. Hey. Come down here. I don't want your spear friend to fight me too. One on one. Oh yeah, I'm not Embered anymore, right? I'm getting sloppy here. Yeah, I got super sloppy there. We got a Lothric Knight Shield, though. Is that good? It's like a big shield. Okay, I don't want that. Oh, no, listen. I know you love the Claymore. I'm not going to take what you say as a bias for the Claymore. I assume it's genuinely good. Question. Are staggers the quote-unquote critical hits? I imagine so. I just wanted to know for sure. Alright. I want to kill this dude, though. I already got him down to full or half health. Come on, do your shiny thing. Do your shiny thing. It'll be funny. What can I say? I'm good at what I know. Okay. That was very fucking close. 
We get a refined gem and a Lothric Knight Gauntlet. Okay. Do I get anything out of killing the Winged Knight over here? I don't remember. Oh, I don't want to deal with you. Okay, accidental drop attack. I'll take it. Steel Soldier Helm. It's probably lighter, but a little bit weaker, right? Better against dark and has better resistances. It's also lighter, yeah. Hey, bud. I haven't seen him do that before. You know what? I'll chance it. I'm going to go with this. Let's go. I got nothing but souls out of that. That's okay. Critical hit is backstabs and the attack after a parry. Okay. I don't know how I survived that, but you know what? We take those. A win is a win. What does it say? Oh. I keep getting confused by all these, like, Discord notifications, but there are people adding my new account. Uh, I'll hold on to this and just go. Well, if I am sticking to the longsword, I know, I know I built up for the claymore, but, like... I have a refined gem now. I had a refined longsword. I'm just gonna- I'm doing what I did before. I know it worked for me. When I get Vort's Great Hammer, I might fuck with that a little bit, just to try it. Because apparently it's really strong. Hello? Could you reinforce my sword? Uh, sorry, infuse my sword. Pretty be, pretty be careful. I like the strength and dex build anyway, so refined works really well for me. I might use raw on the Vort's hammer. Just so I don't have to worry about, like, strength specifically or anything. Let's get raw power out of it. <sighs> I don't know how long I'll be streaming today. You can't infuse boss weapons. Oh, right. I knew that already. I knew that from the dancer. Um. Man, what was I saying, though? Oh, I forgot the binoculars. That's okay. I don't know how long I'll stream today. Probably not too long. Not my full length. I might stop at around 10. We'll see what happens. I also would love to, um... I might stream it on the Discord. Actually, come to think of it. I've already served the purpose of the stream, which was just saying, Hey guys, this is the real me. No, listen, Shield Maiden, you can backseat as much as you want for this specific playthrough. Okay, now, wait, 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 wait. Now that I know what things are, I see our giant archer friend over there. Down there we have... I don't know what that is, actually. That little stone structure there. I guess that's the Road of Sacrifices, maybe? No. Well, that over there is the Cathedral of the Deep. So is that fair? I, this is where I wish I had the binoculars. Yeah, no, I guess that's the road of sacrifices. Right, because that's the, d the downstairs from the tower. We come down through there. We go down the road of sacrifices. We work our way around. Crucifixion Woods is over there. 
And the cathedral's over there. You have no clue what anything is? That's fair. So then that direction... Is that Irithyll or An Orlando maybe? That looks to be An Orlando. Very cool. And then down here, this is the... Oh no, this is Farron Keep. Below us, right? This is Farron Keep. And then that's the catacombs. And then Irithyll would be somewhere around there as well, right? Maybe. I vaguely know where a lot of the things are. I'm starting to make sense of it, though. And I love that. I love replaying it now that I know where things are. Or I know what things look like, I should say. Release the hounds. Then come down to join the fun. What if I just, like, drop here? Yeah, I was gonna say that won't do much damage. We get an alluring skull here. And then we get our friend down over here. So <laughs> oh, 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 oh. So his thing is Abyss Watchers, right? Like, once we've hit the Abyss Watchers, that's too far for him, right? Am I understanding that correctly? Okay. Yeah, my main thing I'm looking at is, like, what's too far for each quest line so I make sure not to pass them. Come on. I wonder how I'd fare in Dark Souls 1 now. Technic- Okay, so I can fight the Abyss Watchers and be fine. It's- If I beat the Abyss Watchers and then enter the Catacombs after that, then I'm fucked. Okay. Hey, friend. I love being good at video games. It's such a blessing. Okay, anything out here? I can try jumping. Ah, oh, you're just letting the dogs out. Very thoughtful gentleman. And I know how to deal with the big mother characters, because it's just cleanse the bastard's curse. Gives me a little hug. I also know Loretta's bone is somewhere around here, too. Can I cross over here, technically? I don't think I ever did this. Just so I can kill that guy? Is that it? Okay. Hey friends, how you doing? We're doing okay, I think. I know this area so fucking well as well. Yeah, let's just let's just move forward. Blow some people up. Oh, my bad. Funny how you guys don't notice me blowing up your friends. Leave me alone. Don't hit me with your little book.
Don't hit me with your book. No matter how many times you ask, she still hits you with the book. Remember to follow the stream if that's relatable content. Hey, <laughs> getting hit by a book. You ever just like want to go for a hug and said they just smack you over the head with the book? Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Get an ember out of that. I'm gonna go for the bonfire that I know. Um, I forgot what the bonfire is called, but it's with the all the, the firebomb throwy dudes. I'll go grab that. Also, praise the soup is this way, too. Mm, we'll go this way first, yeah. These two will drop down normally, but I can kill them now. Bye. Okay. Bye. What is he doing? He's dancing over there. What are you dancing for? This is a no dance zone. Goodbye. Have a good night. Mm, this was the firebomb bonfire was this way. Oh, hi. You're just vibing, I guess? I do have a lot of Steam games. This is true. Excuse me. I knew you were an enemy. Oh, hi. Yeah, part of the reason I'm kind of thrilled that my Dark Souls file got deleted was so I can work through my Steam library a bit more on stream. Um, I th One thing, I haven't mentioned this yet in this stream. I haven't mentioned it for uh, like the plans going forward. I'm going to try to focus more on video content creation. And what I mean by that is, like, I'm still going to do streams, obviously. But, like, how, how I'm doing right now with, like, the record Dark Souls, edit Dark Souls, record We Were Here, edit We Were Here. I'm going to stop doing that. And I'm just going to focus on, like, you know, stream this game, stream that game, record this game, record that game. And kind of keep the streams and the recording separate. Like, stream highlight videos are fine and all, but... I'd rather make unique content for both platforms, I think. Get back into VR chat content a little bit, too, would be fun. I'll still be doing Let's Plays. Like, I'll still do, um... I'll get back to Jump King at some point. I'll do Omori. Maybe some Nintendo titles over on YouTube as well could be fun. So a lot of my kind of planning is going to be based around, like, okay, uh, what game do I stream and what game do I do videos for, you know? Ah, uh, fuck, I think the bonfire was the other direction. Mmm, that's okay. I think I can still get a shortcut if I go this way. Oh, I actually have a video series on Jump King. Oh, hi, you're gonna jump down? I wish you had done that last playthrough. <laughs> Fuck you. Okay, that was too close for comfort. This, I don't think this leads me down to a bonfire, does it? This leads me to the rooftops with these dudes. Oh wait, there is a bonfire here too, actually. 
There's also the twinkly dude. Twinkle bug. I'm not going for you. I'm going for the bonfire. Fuck that. Not the bonfire I was aiming for, but we take it. Omari's the first game you played 100% on Steam. Just start started a Steam last year. Nice. Yeah, 100% in games is very satisfying. It's what I spend most of my time doing when I'm not streaming. I just recently 100%ed... What did I beat recently? Spiritfarer. That game I was streaming and having a good old time with. Come on. Stop doing that. I'm going to try to get through here and make the shortcut. I'll come back for the items once I talk to the giant. The sewer shortcut, I mean. gonna gun for it because I know where I'm going at least then we'll have access to the curse routed great wood also Blinding of Isaac repentance how many hours did you have to put in it to 100% it can I get through the sewers right now I don't need a key right yeah I don't need a key so this will lead up there will lead to the other bonfire. And straight to the sewers will lead me to the other bonfire. Uh, I'll go for the sewer shortcut first, then come back for that one. There's no door here, right? 909... Oh my god. That is a long game to 100%. I know the big mama rats through here. Not too worried. We can punch people now. That's pretty dope. I'm playing really sloppy right now. Got the blood bite ring. Doesn't hurt to put that on. Especially in this area, there's a decent amount of bleed. So we'll have three S's. We're fine to get back to the bonfire. Yeah, the most hours I have in a game is Terraria with like 500 something. So I can only imagine. Thanks, Cheddar. I'm actually almost done here, I think. I might stop now-ish and just switch over to Discord. Yeah. I, I got the point across of what was going on. I'm gonna stop here. I'm gonna be doing a lot of Dark Souls in my free time off stream. I'll probably stream it on Discord. If you guys want to drop in, you don't need a mic to join the voice channel. You can type in the Lobby Lounge channel. Um, that's pretty much all I have to say. So yeah, for the time being, I'm going to end it here. No more Dark Souls going forward until I can get caught up. But for right now, that's just going to be what it is. I'm going to be planning out what we're doing going forward probably tomorrow. I'll let you guys know. If you're not in the Discord, exclamation point Discord, I'll actually do that for you real quick. Uh, make sure you have the Ikebukuro News channel. Or channel. Roll. Don't trust anyone with downloads ever again. Yeah, true. I might make a roll for the Dark Souls streams or just for, like, voice channel streams. Nah, just grab the voice chat roll. I'll probably ping it whenever I'm playing. I use the voice chat roll for proper voice chats as well, though, so I don't know. I'll put a suggestion in the suggestion box. We'll see what people want to do. Everyone, have an amazing rest of your night. I'm going to go drop a raid uh, on my buddy. Actually, let's see what Lex is up to. Have a great night, everyone. I'll see you on the Discord. I'll be vibing on there, probably playing more Dark Souls. 
And uh, yeah, take good care, everyone.